Hi, this is Mark from Wiki Design. In this Blender beginning tutorial, I'm gonna walk you through the basics of selecting vertices, edges, and faces. Learning how to be able to select and control these three different things is gonna be very important before you start doing any sort of advanced modeling. Okay, and so in this example, I have a model that's a little more complex than just the regular cube. So to begin, there's two different modes that you need to be aware of. So everybody that uses Blender, they switch in between these very easily. And that is right here where it says object mode and then edit mode. So these two modes right here are gonna be the ones that you're gonna tab in between. And the good thing is, is that there's a shortcut for this. So you just hit the tab on your keyboard and then you're gonna be able to switch in between the two modes. So I definitely would recommend just hit the tab button instead of going up here every time. Okay, so now when you're inside of edit mode, you're gonna see these three new boxes right here. If you just hover over each one, you can see this is for the uh, vertex select vertices this is going to be for your edges and then this is for your face so it's pretty simple once you click on one of these like i'm going to click on the vertice one now you can go ahead and start clicking the dots around the model so i'm just holding down shift and let's say you just wanted to get these specific uh, vertices that's what you could do right here and then this would be where i can go ahead and do something more advanced like extrude it or bevel it whatever it may be and then if you have something already selected like this, you can just click out here in the middle of nowhere and it will deselect everything. And then now we can go on to the edges. So now same thing, you just hold on shift and you can click on any of these edges within here. You can now like rotate the model, hold down shift. You could do it like that. There's a lot of different ways you're gonna be able to do selections. So if I just wanted to have these ones right here, you could do that. And now I can do whatever I wanted. And then the last one is for your face. So pretty simple, it's gonna select everything that's within the dots and the edges. So that's this is gonna be very helpful. So if I wanted to like extrude that, I would just hold on shift and now I can extrude just that part. Okay, so now I'm gonna show you how you can click and drag and select multiple vertices in this example. So what you can do is just click out in the middle of nowhere, just click and drag. So let's say I wanna get like this part of his face, part of his eye. So you could see when you do that, it looks like it works correctly, but if you start to move the camera, you're gonna notice that these vertices weren't picked up and the ones behind them. So in some situations that might not be ideal. So what you're gonna have to do is, there's a thing right here called the toggle X-ray. The shortcut is Alt-Z. And what you do is you just click that and then go back into your selection. You could do it in wireframe, you could do it in the shaded mode right here, whatever is gonna work. So now if I know I wanna get everything from like this part of his eye, for example, now when I move the camera, you're gonna see it selected all those ones that were missed before. And then of course from here you can do whatever you need. And of course with Blender there's a million different shortcuts. So now these right here are all driven by a shortcut. So what you could do is just toggle in between the numpad on your keyboard. It's a one, a two, and a three. So when you click one is vertice, two is the edge. So when I hit two, it's the edge. And then I hit three, it's the faces right here. So I definitely recommend hitting the tab and then toggling in between these ones right here, one, two, and three, because you could always go up to the menu and do this. And if you're beginning, it might be okay for a little bit, but I definitely recommend learning the shortcuts because that's gonna save you a lot of time because there are a lot of times where like, I would need to go in here real quick and select things. And instead of having to go up here, you know, and clicking every time, it's gonna save you tons and tons of time. And then of course, if you need to select everything, that's pretty simple. You just hit the uh, shortcut A and then A just selects all of your things. So it would select all of your edges, or in this case, if I hit A, it's gonna select all my faces. And then the last one I recommend learning is the invert. So there are times where if you need to select everything but a few different like faces, for example, this one could uh, speed up the process too. So let's say I just wanna uh, select these two right here, but I actually want the inverse. So what you can do is underneath select, uh, I won't cover all of these in this tutorial, but you're gonna see that there's a whole bunch of different ones in here. So I definitely recommend kind of going in here, playing around, seeing which ones are gonna be useful. But you can always invert with control I, and what that's gonna do is select everything but the two I selected. So there are cases where that might actually speed up the process. And that's it for this quick Blender beginning tutorial on how to select your vertices, edges, and faces. And make sure you subscribe to this YouTube channel where I'm gonna be releasing more Blender tutorials like this. Again, this is Mark from Wiki Design.